The Pilot Pete Bachelor TV saga may be long over, but Peter Weber's ex, Madison Pruitt, caused some turbulence during a recent interview that caused him to drag her on social media. So grab the popcorn and get comfy. What's up, y'all? I'm Emil Ennis Jr. back here with Clever News. And just because The Bachelor production was put on an indefinite hold doesn't mean the drama has to be. When in quarantine, apparently all the rules are completely tossed out the window, like dating someone you dumped on national TV, breaking all contract rules, or exposing text messages between a thirsty ex. Little do we know, we've been tuning into a virtual reality show right before our eyes because The Bachelor stars are giving us all we need to be entertained for the time being. Since Peter Weber's season ended back in March, he has since broken up with Madison, shacked up with Kelly, been dragged by an entire group of contestants, and is now attempting to save face after Madison basically exposed their text conversations during a podcast with former Bachelor star Caitlin Bristow. Yeah, it hasn't exactly been smooth sailing for Pilot Pete. So we're about to dish all the dirt that went down, but before we do, don't forget to subscribe to Clever News and ring that bell so you never miss a breaking news update. All right. So it's basically a rite of passage upon leaving The Bachelor franchise to start up your own podcast. And if you don't, you probably left by week two. That said, Caitlin Bristow's successful Off the Vine podcast is continuing on strong during the quarantine, as this week's guest was none other than Madison Pruitt, AKA Peter's final choice, after he had proposed to Hannah Ann and dumped her shortly after. Madison didn't hold back one single thing and exposed Peter's text to her while claiming that he wanted her back just two days after he was spotted in Chicago with Kelly Flanagan. To be honest, what was really confusing to me uh, <laughs> is that two days before he was spotted in Chicago, he was like calling me and texting me <laughs> and being like, I miss you, let's get back together. And so, I mean, I think that to me was a little confusing. Maddie went on to add, quote, I think like, when you break up and you're going through a heartbreak and you just came off a show that was emotionally, physically, and very which way exhausting, everybody handles that differently. Everybody leans on different things. These quotes basically shook Bachelor Nation and were shared on pretty much every Bachelor gossip site, so it was only a matter of time until Peter got word of what was said. Thankfully, he didn't leave us hanging for too long when he took to Bachelor gossip account Bachelor Nation Scoop to fire back with, Madison, you think you'd have a little more respect for this situation given we both know there's more to the story. But we need the rest of the story. Oh, but I should mention that the cherry on top of this whole thing is that Madison quickly unfollowed Pete on Instagram shortly after this interview, which means that she probably has no interest in responding to him. I just have to point out though that all throughout his entire season and even after it ended, Pete has literally been dragged through the mud by his former girlfriend. Not like we're counting, but between Hannah Ann comparing his penis to bland cauliflower and then saying he's not hot or manly, Maddie dragging him through the mud on a live podcast, Tammy creating shady TikToks about Peter, and Sydney pulled a Mariah Carey and asked the fan, who is Peter? This guy might want to consider fleeing the country. Maddie may not share any further comments on the Peter situation, but she did take to a Bachelor fan account that shared a collective group of screenshots of everyone who shaded Peter and Kelly writing, LOL, it was just a joke, no shade, all the love for them both. Yeah, I'm not sure I'm buying that, but I've honestly never seen a Bachelor receive this much hate. And even though he made some questionable decisions during his time on air, do you guys think he deserves this much scrutiny? And were Maddie's confessions of their personal conversations justified? Chime in down below in the comments, but just know that there are fans who are actually coming to Pete's defense. One user wrote, Damn, you could tell in his interviews he has been very gentle with the Maddie situation and can tell he was expecting the same. Eek. Other fans are claiming that all this drama combined has been better than his entire season and they're not wrong. But fans who stood by Maddie throughout this season are still standing by her and living for her exposing all the tea. This fan wrote, Peter's just mad he looks shady now. His ex-girlfriend before the show and Hannah Ann called him out too. Maddie was actually nice about him. And another Bachelor Nation member added, she was way too nice to him and Kelly for that matter. All she said was it hurt her and she was shocked. Like, duh. Where was he when Hannah Ann was insulting his manhood? Madison is a true queen. We're really making up for lost Bachelorette production time after Claire Crawley's season has been postponed, but it's safe to assume that Bachelor Nation is living for the dirt. We're bringing you all the Hollywood tea here every day, and for even more TV show shockers, click right over here to watch Shailene Woodley expose secrets from the secret life of an American teenager. I'm Emil Innes Jr., and I'll see you soon right back here on Clever News. Bye, guys.